Hi, he said from Zetster's lap. I'm busy, I'm busy, I'm busy. Uh, a while back, I thought, you know, there's a huge Christmas market at the tramway building in Port Elizabeth. It's for all the local artist. artists. So I thought, mm, let me try and find out if I can have a little stall there or something. It was just... One day I just got up and I got this idea. So I've contacted them and blah, blah, blah. They're very excited. So I got a little stall at the Christmas market. That would have been from the 16th to, the, I don't know, for four days. Just before Christmas. And then just as I was busy with all my things and I was ready to go and I've got had everything under control. I, it was so funny. I was actually lying in bed with morning, me and hubby, and I was telling him about all my ideas for this stall, for my stall and how I'm going to be there and sit there and paint and chat to everybody and just enjoy myself you know and how I can explain all my paintings and the meaning and blah 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 very excited and then the next minute there comes a whatsapp it's it's the woman that's organizing me for the Christmas market let's call it that no the market's gonna change because of COVID uh, that's really bad now all around us. We're going to have it in a shop. N and listen to this. From the 1st to the 24th of December. Now. And I don't have to be there 24-7. Now. Everything changed. In the blink of an eye. My whole idea changed. All of a sudden I needed barcodes. I needed to list all my things, know what everything's going to cost beforehand, make little things to put on. And then she said, I, she thinks I need to put it in plastic bags and now I don't have big enough plastic bags for my music sheet things. And oh my goodness, all of a sudden it's just crazy. So what should I do? One day at a time. One thing at a time. Just do what the life in me allows me to do today with no expectations. You see, the thing is we've got all these expectations of how things are supposed to turn out. And they never do and then we fall apart. So... To live life in heaven now, to experience peace and joy in the midst of any situation, you've got to have no strict expectations. Otherwise, you're going to be permanently hysterical. You've got to realize you've got to go with the flow of life in you, the spirit in you, how he is leading, directing, showing you the way by circumstances that's changed. I don't need to decide and know what to do next and what I'm going to do in 10 days time. All I need to do and know is that now the life in me is directing me and showing me what I need to do today now by how situations is unfolding. If a door's closed, leave it. If there's no door open, do nothing and wait and the right time a door will open and you will know what to do next. So yes, today I am very, very busy. I got my little tickets or name tags yesterday. So today I'm putting name tags on each and every one of my paintings. You know me, they got a story. So I'm busy writing all the stories and then put it on the back. And then I've got my large paintings that I will have to 
hang and get ready to hang. So there's lots of things. So what will tomorrow bring? I have no idea. But I'm excited to be alive now and do what the spirit in me is allowing me to do now and then see what's going to happen. What's going to happen there? With all my things now all over the shop and me not there and I'm not there to explain and talk and you know share my life with my customers so I've got no idea what's going to happen. But I, one thing I do know this life is all about relationships. It's all about stepping stones. What I do now is a stepping stone for what I will have to do next. And I've got only light. The light is in me. The life and light is in me. That shows me only the next step. So my next step or the step that I'm in now, on now, is write all my things, put it on my canvases, my paintings. That's what I wanted to do all along so that when you buy a painting or I give you a painting that you have the meaning. So I'm doing that. So a fantastic day is developing. All is well. My life is unfolding perfectly. I've got no idea where I'm going, how it's going to go, but I trust that all is well that my life is unfolding perfectly. How? By minute by minute, day by day, just walking in the light that is right in front of me, doing what this life in me allows me to do right now, today, and not worry about tomorrow or the future, not having any preconceived ideas or how things are supposed to turn out and blah, blah, blah. That's not my part. My part is to go with the flow of the life that is in me, showing me the way. And now my coffee is burning because I put coffee on the stove and I could smell them and it's ready. So let me go and drink my coffee and continue. Thanks for joining me. Have a fantastic day. And your life is unfolding perfectly. Just drop all the preconceived ideas of you believe your life is going to unfold because it's not going to happen that way or your children's lives or the country or whatever. We don't know. All that we know is that now all our needs are met and life is unfolding perfectly. Life is in us, showing us the way right now. Have a fantastic day. I'll keep you posted. <laughs>